Well good morning and welcome once again to Ed's Orchids. Now yesterday somebody came and gave me this uh, Dracula. There's no name to the Dracula so I don't know what it is. And they said they'd had it uh, oh, a few years and it's done absolutely nothing. It's never flowered or anything. And uh, we'll just take the camera and have a quick look. I'll just take it off this. There we are. And you can see all the tips of all the leaves are brown. It's in a little uh, a correct slatted holder there. Not very deep, so I don't think that will help the uh, the Dracula. So we'll just take it out of its spot and have a look see if it's got any roots. Well, it's held on by some pretty strong wire. So what I'll do, I'll cut the wires off. I don't need them again, I don't think. There's so many wires on here, it's unbelievable. Ooh. There we are. That's that off. Now can we take it out of its uh, pot? I don't know. We'll have a quick look, see what we can do. See all the little things growing out of it, a little clover or something. It's, see how long it's been there. I think if we see any roots, we'll be lucky. Here it comes. Well, there's new growth on it all over the place. I mean, just here I can see one, two, three, four, five, six new growths there. Well, let's have a look at the... And it's in moss. You can see new growth here, but I think it's in time. It's really time it was repotted, this. don't have any moss to pot it in but I'm going to a big show this weekend so I might pick up I don't know I just want everything in lava rock don't I but this needs a good cleaning up so I'll come back to you in a minute One, two, three. Well, I've just been picking and poking at this with a, a bamboo skewer, getting all sorts of stuff out. And the more I take out the rotten stuff here, the more it's looking like it's going to split. Look at it, easy. There's one here somewhere that's just dropping just dropping apart, there we are. Sorry. Look. Now that's got some new roots in and some nice growth there. So I don't know what to do with this plant yet. Whether to leave it four or five days like this until I can get some uh, some new sphagnum moss. because I think and I really think that these types of plants will do better in lava rock and better in uh, moss than lava rock well I'm going to have to take this one off because it's going to drop off 
so we should just tease it a little bit there we are it's off already and that'll get planted up separately but the new growth on here is unbelievable one two three four five six seven eight nine at least a dozen new growths there so it's a it's a wonderful plant these but uh, a lot of these roots are dead and how do i take them off or do i leave them on i think maybe i'll leave them on i'll just take off what's loose but i just don't know what i'm going to do with this I really don't want to split it because it's such a beautiful plant. But it's always got a natural place to split it. And where is that natural place? There we are. That's a natural place to split it. But I don't really want to do that. But what I want to do with it is, I have no idea. found just a little bit of moss so uh, what I've done I've put some uh, RO water in here make it nice and warm and I've soaked all the moss now in uh, seaweed extract so that will give the uh, the plant a good boost I think so what I propose to do is get some of this uh, this moss Squeeze it out. Take the plant. Sit it on there. And it looks like here. It looks like it's a, a flower growth. Because if you notice, all these roots here are white. And that one is like purple. And I think those are the uh, growing tips. Just a minute, I'll have to get some more. Squeeze it out. And put it round the top. Make sure it's nice and covered. We'll just lay it down while we get some more. A bit fiddly this with not having that uh, long long pieces of uh, sphagnum moss but this should do very very nicely that'll keep it nice and damp I've got a pot here I've put plenty of holes in it and we'll just nestle that in there and that should keep that one okay until I can get some better moss That'll live okay in there for, it'll only be in for four days at the most. So that's that, uh, I should say, a little division. So what I propose to do uh, short, short term with this plant is to put it back where it came from into there with some bit of new moss that I've got. Should it be all right for... Uh, as I say in the short term so uh, until I get some new moss this coming Saturday uh, I 
just like to thank you for uh, having a look at this. It all, but I'm bored you too much. And uh, until Sunday for this plant, I'll see you later. Okay, bye.